your square hands back. You ready? You probably did 63 divided by that. We're going to figure out what your strike zone is. The whole motivation behind the science of baseball is to get kids interested in math and science, specifically engineering degrees, mathematics degrees, because we have a tremendous shortage of technical people in this country. Who thinks he's Yankees and Giants? I get to interact with the science and math and play baseball at the same time. What's your favorite part of the program? Oh, like, getting to play baseball and learning the physics of baseball and getting to meet, like, really important people. So I've had all these nice things happen to me, and, and really the root of it is that I made a decision to get my, yes, I made a decision to get my degree. Maybe they learn that the optimal angle of trajectory for a home run is 35 degrees. They learned that in the classroom in the morning, then they're gonna go try it on the field in the afternoon. It's his strike zone ratio of 8.4, once we calculate it. So you're gonna take those measurements and then you're gonna calculate that ratio that you have, that, that's your own ratio, and then you're gonna see what that will be. I think it's great. I think it's a great way to get kids interested in engineering. And I mean, as a softball player, I never really thought about, I, of course I know there's underlying concepts of science, but I never thought about the physics of hitting and the ratios like we talked about today of um, the strike zone. Our hope is that the people who go, go through this program will actually be more interested in college, be more interested in math and science, and actually prepare themselves for the SAT. If we get them in high school, it's too late.